we in the Midland Caravan Park at the moment. Busy packing food and goodies because we're going on a bicycle journey. So we're packing panniers and everything. And then we're going to head up into the hills. In the hills. So here's all our bags. Uh, not that one. It goes back on the ute. Trunk bags. Getting everything ready. It's the one bike. Ten tents on the top already. So, yeah. Helmets. And um, this is where we're going. Mundaring to Jarradale. Well, we're going to go Jarradale to Mundaring. So we just uh, arrived in Jarradale with a taxi. Very expensive taxi, but 150 odd dollars. But here we are. Hello. And um, we had lunch. <coughs> What's the time? Half past one. Half past one. We're only starting the trail now. Comes the most gorgeous cyclist in the world. Hello, gorgeous. Yeah, so <laughs> <laughs> we've just done an extra twenty-three six Ks, I think. And that's what the road, Bullich Road, looked like. Still pretty though. We've made it here again. We had to do a massive loop. We were probably about, I don't know, six, seven kilometers on this road. That's the way to Jarradale. And uh, this is the last little section. So we made it to this place, Wungong. However, you know, want to say it. 39 kilometers. Hello! We're pretty pooped. Yes, it's a. Uh... Busy packing up the tent. Good morning. We're not used to sleeping on the ground anymore. <laughs> Been spoiled with a rooftop tent on the ute, but. We slept well. Bit of rain last night. But a beautiful, clear sky, it seems. Yes, yeah, not bad here. It's pretty good actually. Can't complain. Um, <clears throat> this is where I'll show you on the map. Jarradale. So we went all along here. That's where we got stopped for the rally. All these roads were closed. So we kind of came back and tried to make our way through here on the main road. And so I don't think we did much more. Uh, we estimate about 6Ks extra, but yeah, so that's where we are. On the road again. Isn't your bicycle the wrong way around? Yeah. It's bust. Try to pedal uphill and bent and broke the whole thing. So we'll try and fix it. Otherwise we might have to hike. <laughs> keep, keep dropping it, eh? It's coming out. Dropped it. Did it go all the way out? Just straighten this. Bend it straight to the pliers. There was the bend. I think it was there. And that's the direction we came from. So, I don't know, I think we've done two k's or so, maybe more since the fix. We're heading that way. It's about 11 o'clock now. Pretty warm, about 35.
as you can see it's pretty hot 41.9 degrees Celsius we've just crossed the uh, Brookton Highway we're kind of there now heading heading over there uh, pretty good terrain has changed it's very sandy and loose at one section pretty bugger day eh? pooped, pooped. <laughs> yep it's five k's I think to the camp and then we'll decide still early but yeah She might be a snake. <laughs> I think it is. I think I'm not going any closer. Anyway, it's pretty steep up here. We've made it to the camp. Uh, Carinia. Uphill climb all the way there, like we bug it. Well, it's only early, two o'clock. We'll spend about an hour here and see how we feel. Fill up all our waters, which is all we're almost dry. Luckily, there's water in the tanks. Yeah, but it's nice here, yeah? pretty, pretty. It is. I think this camp is a nicer one. Yeah, it's nicer than another one, definitely. Baby, yeah. it's not easy. It's a lot of appeals and pea gravel and gum nuts, too. Horrible things. <sighs> Tire. Nourishment. Some energy. Oh, well, we've. I think we've just done forty kilometers. Really? <laughs> no wonder I'm pooped. Yeah. It's our longest day. So far, I'm telling you, the track's pretty good here, but there were sections where I don't think I'll be able to ride with a normal mountain bike. It's just way too loose, like sand and everything. This was one serious uphill. Yep. We had a serious downhill before this. So we've come as far as this place, just next to the track. We've done 50 kilometers. Uh, some sort of about to go down. Well, he's down, but still have some light. Cook some <coughs> busy cooking dinner. Um, yeah. We are having Uncle Ben's brown rice and stuff. This was uh, next last. Morning. 
I'm not used to the ground sleeping, but uh, we feel refreshed. I do. And getting to make some coffee. It's probably five o'clock in the morning. We're just consulting maps. There might be a shortcut. So that's the way the window buddy goes. So we kind of come here, I think. It's a lovely section, this. Really good. <clears throat> Saw two big kangaroos earlier on. Don't know who got the bigger fright, them or us. But, yeah. Anyway, pretty loose, you can see. Let's struggle with a normal bound the bike here. Or I would my weight. I'm happy we're riding these big tyres. They're good. Not having much luck with my chains today or well, yesterday this trip. Just snapped the chain. Brock in. I don't know. Falling too much weight I think. It's one modification I might have to think about. All back fixed again just broke broke one of the links and put a new mast link in I was a bit in too high gear to try and go up here so my own fault put it all back together head on this is that loose stuff I was talking about it's horrible it's, I don't think a normal mountain bike Especially going uphill, you won't go uphill on this, I don't know. No. Anyway. So, this is the crossroads. Here. We're going to bail out now and get our way to Kalamanda. Go back to Midland. This was a lovely experience. Lovely. Awesome. <laughs> Civilized roads. We had enough now. We had a massive heavy duty mountain bike trail. Comes a T junction. Let's see where we are. Fern Road. We're heading that way, I think. Is it? No. We've got to go that way. Where are you going? I don't know where you want to go. If we go that way, we're going back to where. That's. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. I don't want to go uphill, so we no. go downhill. We just come up the Calamander Road. Another excellent workout for the legs. You will always fool me out this when I'm buggered. We made it back, it's all our gear, uh, not that, came out of a ute, bicycles, in Midland, we've done 115 kilometers, so we got a nice little room here, we'll sleep tonight and go home tomorrow. Yeah, legs are a little bit like Jenny and starting to tighten up here. <laughs> We had some serious hills at Kalamanda this morning, but we made it. Thank you, Lord. <laughs>